Hello everyone, today I'm going to discuss about how to do the API formatting in the MS Word and in this tutorial I'll be showing how to set up the font, the font size and the padding and the margin of the page and how you can also export this format to your PDF and also and upload anywhere, anywhere you want. So let's do not get further and check out how to do the API format in the MS Word. So first of all to do this you need to create a new word file in your word and after creating the new file you just need to set the margin first of all you set the font from here uh, suppose you take this font size 12 uh, it's the standard font size i recommend for you and, and then uh, you can just use any font like i recommend the times new roman because this font is the default and also available in every pc around the world so it's the basic so i just set up the font and now you need to go to your the page layout section uh, from here you need to the, determine the margins and in the margin section you need to set the normal uh, that means the top one is uh, left one is bottom one is the uh, right one is and now you select everything uh, one is from the normal formatting and now in the paragraph section you need to set up a uh, the things that is the line spacing uh, you can see here is the line spacing is multiple but you need to set uh, it as double and uh, in the spacing uh, the default is 10 pt you need to set it to zero now this is all the margin setup now you if you want to access the header of a page in your word file you cannot see any header but if you click on the top two times you can see the header pop up and now you need to deter, uh, declare a header of your research paper or anything you want to do you need to do, uh, write the topic name suppose i am using uh, a topic that is called science and technology so i will uh, write the topic name here science and technology i write here and now i will uh, have to declare the page name uh, on the side on the right side of this so what i need to do i just go to uh, insert and then i go to the page number you can find in every word uh, this option uh, you need to go to the page number and now you select the current position if you select the top of the page then it will uh, replace your title uh, that you will write science and technology and, and now you just select the current position and the plane number you can select the plane number or if you want to select any other format then you can also choose from here like the current position and uh, with the number page one or something like this so you just select this and uh, you give space and place it at the right side so it looks good and now you if you want to exit from the header section just uh, double click on your body of the page and you will get out of the header section now you can see there is a transparent uh, written on the top now what you need to um, do is start your uh, research paper on the top so you basically do many things that is uh, you need to set up the margin and the text position paragraph uh, is center now you uh, give some enter and you will uh, come to the bottom and now you uh, write your topic name science and technology in my case and now write your name and your university name and or maybe your research name and who, who who's uh, for whose you do the research and, and this will be your font page and after uh, doing the font page you do not need to paste uh, a lot of enter to go to the next page you can simply uh, jump to next page by um, uh, go to the insert section and from here you can see option that page break if you uh, click on the page break uh, then it will automatically uh, create a new page you can also do uh, this uh, by creating uh, a shortcut and that is control plus enter if you press control plus enter from your keyboard then you can just press control plus enter and it will uh, create a new page now you can see there is automatically added the header and you can see the sign and technology your topic name and also the page number it is automated count how many pages you write on your topic and all the page number will automatically add to your 
PDF format or also in the Word file. So after uh, getting to the second page, you can write something about your uh, about your topic or something that you what is the research paper actually is and how you can get your uh, get your uh, the resource and where you can get this. Uh, you can uh, write this here uh, like uh, the about the. Uh, you can uh, create a page about their research paper and now you can you can shortly be your what is inside of this research paper and what actually is this so after um, creating all of the things uh, you next uh, create another new page and uh, from here you can start your body of the research paper and from here you can write the topic name again so on the new page uh, you write uh, your topic name uh, science and technology and now you can start your writing but before uh, writing you need to set up uh, your text position to the uh, left side as we use the left side and on the first line you need to uh, place a tab then you will start uh, a new line here uh, and it will it will uh, make some space uh, from the first word uh, you can see you can see there is a tab but if, if we enter a new line you can see the uh, text uh, is starting from the top most left so uh, this is how you can uh, do the formatting and uh, now another thing is the reference declaration for the reference declaration you need to uh, reference uh, declare what is uh, actually you get the information from where and you can uh, make this a number like Like uh, we 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 declare uh, something that Samsung Note 7 uh, blast in 2017, and uh, but uh, you need to declare how, where is the reference, and uh, to declare the reference, you can uh, you can use the uh, bracket uh, on this, and you can number this like uh, you can use this uh, star star mark or any number. Uh, I just uh, give here two star, and uh, you can use uh, this as reference. And uh, to do the reference, you can do two types two things you can uh, use the reference at the last page of your research paper or on the bottom of your page to declare on the bottom i will show you uh, you just need to go to your bottom and on the bottom you just uh, click uh, double times like the header you uh, come in and if you click on the bottom you can see the footer and in the footer section you can uh, write the reference you can see I, I write a reference and uh, from here you can you can write the that write the code so, uh, you can see we have uh, put two stars there so I just uh, declare here the two stars and what actually mean is why is 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 uh, tell that the phone is a uh, blast uh, we just uh, add the link or at the um, at the website name or the book name uh, on here like this you can uh, add more like you declare another one uh, you can uh, you can use this this way this way you can uh, declare the reference of uh, your resources that you include your body so this is how you can do your API format another thing is also uh, you can uh, create a new page on the last and uh, in the in here you just uh, uh, write a topic name like the reference references and you just uh, make it centers and uh, keep a little bit big as it look uh, like you want and now you can start typing the reference like the uh, one or uh, like the 1.1 or something 1.2 uh, this way and you can mention all the uh, site name on the books name like the books book name from where you you get the reference or something like this and the author's name and other things uh, you can find the more details uh, in this section so you just need to write the book name the author name and the page number uh, like this way you can uh, format the references and it will uh, show, it will properly uh, describe the API format for your report so i hope you understand what is the api format and how you need to do this work and uh, by this work uh, you can uh, complete your 
this is the paper now what how you can uh, convert it to your pdf you just need to go to your file section and from here you can see an option that save and send and from here you can see an option that create pdf or express documents from here you can select create pdf and now uh, there is a button to create pdf or express just click on here and on the next page they will pop up window and uh, they will ask for the format you can say express or pdf i just select pdf and the location where you want to save the uh, pdf i just uh, save it on my uh, desktop and i just click publish when i click publish it will automatically save my uh, all the documents as a pdf and uh, you can uh, directly access your pdf like this one you can see my pdf has already been generated so this is all about the api formatting and the pdf for what you need to do for your research paper so i hope you guys like the video if you like the video please uh, hit the thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe my channel thank you